hi guys welcome back to my channel and today i will be doing a very very exciting video it's gonna be about the euro cup you know you guys all know the european cup it's been like amazing like it's been super hard games there's been like super super duper 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 hard games there has been like you know england versus germany belgium versus portugal there's big games coming up the group stage is finished and now we're going to be moving and now there's going to be a round of 16. so today i will be talking about mostly about england of what's going on in England and also about the Wolves players so also Portugal and what's going on so first of all we will be talking about the England players that play in the Premier League so first of all we're gonna start off with England so England have been doing really well England have been like really just dominating Grealish we all know Grealish he's been doing really good but we not big fans of Grealish, but hey, we hope he does good and make and hopefully he does good to help England get to the semifinals and win the quarterfinals. Cause uh, Grealish is really connecting a lot with Harry Kane. He's connecting really well. He's been doing great assist. Wow. Ooh great cross to sterling and then sterling hits header and then it goes in Whew. great job england so there's also another wolves player we're not going to be talking about Grealish anymore so we just talked about Grealish and how he's doing and how england need Grealish. but now who else is from wolves that is from england connor cody when is he gonna play he has not played like i haven't seen him playing like he hasn't been playing like it's horrible like why is he Co cody not playing that is the question is he doing bad in the trainings and the warm-ups did they have a game and he was in and he didn't do that well what's going on connor cody best captain in wolves probably career like he's one of the top captains in the premier league and why is he not playing in the euros i don't know and uh so that was it about england the england news about the euro we're going to be talking about mostly about england and portugal so england have been doing really well they qualified for the quarter the quarter round of 16 hopefully they do well in the round of 16 let's hope Grealish find does more good passes so we can get to the semi-finals and win the quarterfinals you know let's get to the semi-finals well, let's get to the semi-finals England we could do it we have some great talent going on come on and yeah so Connor Cody hasn't been really playing so very sad for him okay we are done with England news now we'll be talking about Portugal so Portugal Belgium versus Portugal it's gonna be a great game like Portugal have been doing really well like they played against France they draw 2-2 two, two. i will be talking about more about that later but yeah let's talk about the wolves players like in uh like in portugal and uh the wolves players like in portugal and belgium because belgium versus portugal big game wolves players guess who's there did anchor versus real patri rui patricio man dead onker is playing for belgium 
he's been playing he hasn't been playing he's been playing not like connor cody he's been actually doing pretty well he's did anchor has been playing it's gonna be did anchor versus real rui patricio man man it's gonna be an intense game so uh, Portugal have been doing actually pretty well. They 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 were third place, but they qualified. They had more goal points than the other third places. But yeah, they're in the round of sixteen. Hopefully, Portugal might go to the semifinals. Man, we're really hoping that Portugal goes to the semifinals, the quarterfinals, wins the quarterfinals, and goes to the semifinals, and might even go to the final. So, yeah. So now. So in Portugal, we were noticing that Jota connected with Ronaldo. They've been doing really well. There's been lots of connections. Like Jota has been doing assists to Ronaldo. They're connecting very well. And kind of like Raul and Jota, and also Adama. They've been connecting like that. They were connecting really well. Uh, man, Patricio, he's on fire. He's on fire in the Euros. Like, let's hope Roma doesn't buy. Patricio, because, you know, Patricio, whew, awesome goalkeeper, like, top-class goalkeeper. He's been doing really well in the Euros, and he did really well against France, like, against France, like, look, like, look at that save, like, he dives, like, dives, and he, great save, he just touches it, and then it hits the bar then it bounces off man what a save like i watched that game against france portugal versus france that was unbelievable man that's been unbelievable for Rui patricia he's been doing really well like i'm really really happy for patricia so yeah the euros has been going really well competitive games Gonna be more competitive games in the round of sixteen. Even in, it's gonna be more competitive in in the quarterfinals, and even more in the semifinals. And in the finals, gonna be the compet the most competitive. So it's gonna it's gonna be tough. There's gonna be hard games in the round of sixteen. Really hard games. I, hopefully you guys are watching them, because there has been there is gonna be some really good games. So watch Wolves players play wolves players because that's gonna happen <sighs> so yeah so we're done talking about the wolves players and the england and about england and how they're doing because we're obviously we're both rooting for england and portugal hopefully england wins the euros and i don't know who could win imagine like like England play Portugal in the final. I don't know who's going to win. It's going to be tough. That's actually a pretty tough question. Like, I don't know who would win. So, hopefully that's the final. That's what we're hoping for. Now we're talking about English Premier League players versus English Premier League players. Like, Bruno Fernandes. And it's, so, there's going to be, like, Premier League versus Premier League, but just different players. England versus Portugal. Hopefully that's the final. That's what I'm hoping for. That's what I'm really hoping for. So, yeah, guys. So we're done talking about England and Portugal and about the Wolves players playing in England and Portugal. So the Euros has been really tough. So, yeah, let's hope there's going to be more good games and let's hope England and Portugal do really well. So guys, this was the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Just an update about Wolves, England, Portugal. The Wolves players in Portugal and England doing all well. Like, man. So yeah, this was the end of the video. I hope you liked this update of the Euros for England and Portugal. And also the Wolves players who are playing in both of those countries. So anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.